Good morning. Welcome to Business Growth Accelerator Live. Hey, this is about having a business that can earn you even more money without you being there all the time. Now, I'm hearing from business owners that it's tough at present, that they're feeling vulnerable and nervous. And this has got nothing to do with the pandemic. It's just the fact that they're feeling nervous, they're apprehensive about making money, how they're going to get clients how they're actually going to uh, receive the income they want or even have the time off. So they're putting themselves in a difficult mental position because business owners, the self-talk are actually, they're talking themselves out of uh, having a great business. And this needs to change because the overall vision that needs to be at the forefront of your mind is simple strategies for serious business owners who are wanting solid results. Now the thing is, it's interesting because 80% of business owners, when they start a business, won't be here in five years' time. Of those business owners that are left, 80% of those business owners won't be there after 10 years. That means that there's only 4% of businesses still going after 10 years. And here's the kicker. Only 1% of those business owners are actually making money. So the question I need to ask you is that, do you want to be in that 4% that are still ticking over, or do you actually want to be in the 1% that is making money? Because if you do, then business is about strategy, all right, 10%, but mindset makes up 90% of business. So you've got to have the right mindset to actually have a really successful business because when your self-talk is of opportunities, you're going to have a great business because you can actually probably weather most things. Now the thing is that Business Growth Accelerator is just the start because we've got multiple products. But Business Growth Accelerator is the start of your journey where you're actually going to have a really successful business. And this is where Janelle and I can guide you and serve you. Now this morning we were out um, trimming the hedges along the pathway that we have near uh, Favishami. We call it the poo track. The simple fact is that it goes round by the sewerage ponds. Uh, and it's become really overgrown. Now, the thing is that we had to have the right tools to do uh, the clearing. So I've got one of those uh, uh, multi strimmers, all right, still make them. So you, you can put a chainsaw onto it. You can put a hedge trimmer onto it. You can uh, put a uh, trimmer, a strimmer line onto it. And also a, uh, a multi-serve uh, trimmer as well that cuts off the grass. So we have all those things. So we had the right tools for the job. Had I only gone out with the hedge trimmer, I would have only been able to do probably a third of the job that I needed to do. And it's the same in your business. You've got to have the right tools to actually run and operate your business. Because if you only have half the tools, then you're not going to be able to operate it. And then I'll tell you what, we had several people walk along the track and they spoke to us. And that was really interesting. And what they actually said to us was, and here's the problem that quite often you get when you're actually running a business, because the problem is, how do you have the right tools and how do you actually have people letting you know that you're going in the right direction? Because business can be lonely because you are the business owner. And sometimes it's like farming. You actually don't know uh, how your crop is doing because you sow it and it doesn't nothing actually happens uh, for the first few days, few weeks, or even the first few months. So how do you solve the problem? Well, quite simply, you've got to believe in yourself. It comes down to this mindset. Remember what I said before, 90% of business is mindset, 10% is strategy. So you've got to have that self-belief that if you're sowing the right seeds in your business, you're going to have a great business. And there's going to be difficulties along the way because not all the seeds that you sow are going to actually come up to plants. All right, you ask any farmer and they'll realize that uh, part of their crop will never germinate because the seeds aren't wrong. So in your business, it's so important that you have the right tools so you can actually make the right decisions, but you've actually got the tools that are going to help and serve your clients. So they come to you for the solution and you've got the tools in your business that is going to help them with that. And that's how you solve that problem. Now, when Janelle and I were out on the track today, we had several people pass us and they thanked us 
for what we were doing, which was right, kind of nice. It was quite humbling. But you know what? You always have one person who's going to be negative, don't you? All right. And it's the same in your business. And if you listen to these naysayers, you're not going to get anywhere. And this person said to me, how come you're making so much noise? We're in the middle of nowhere by this. Who's going to clean up this track? And I said to him, that's an interesting question, isn't it? Who do you think should clean it up? And he said, well, you should, shouldn't you? And I said, yeah, I think I should as well. I said, what about you? And he said, it's not my responsibility. And I said, do you use this track? Do you walk uh, each day on it? He said, yes. And I said, well, isn't that interesting that you are abdicating your responsibility to help look after something that you use? And I'll tell you, he got really upset when I said this. But it's the fact of the matter that sometimes, or in all times in business, you have to take responsibility as well for what you're doing. So today, don't worry about the naysayers. All right, look at the people that are giving you positive vibes. Look at yourself as well with your business to how you're going. Because if you listen to the naysayers, um, then you're going to keep doing the same thing over and over again. And you know what the definition of insanity is? Doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. It just doesn't work. But if you have a guide or a mentor who's going to guide and help you to put in the right tools into your business, to help you go in the right direction, to help you when those negative thoughts come sitting on your uh, uh, on your shoulder, then you're going to have a really good business. So there's the uh, 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 there's your tip for the day: business growth accelerator. Now, if you like it, I think yeah, you can see the business growth accelerator here. Please click on it, and if you liked it, please share this, uh, like it, comment on it. But if you'd like to join Business Growth Accelerator, then this criteria, please come and uh, join us. We'd love to have you if you meet the criteria. There's your tip for the day. We'll see you tomorrow. And how do I turn this off?